Hey guys, what's going on? It's Deepfield Gamer and sup. I hope you liked that lame video, but now I'm gonna be showing you a six crown battle, guys. A three crown versus three crown draw. And after that, we'll do a battle with this deck, with this really, really good minor deck. Okay, so let's look at this. Okay. So, here we go. So, it's what person from my clan called Dracula Itagi versus um, like another guy from some clan. So, pretty good decks. Uh, Dracula Itagi has a hog and a, a giant in the same deck, and he has a giant, which he totally relies on that. And the other person has a giant balloon deck with rage. So it was a pretty strong deck and it was a good um, type of uh, game. So, so these two just totally ignore uh, the giants on both sides and they take those towers down. Um, you know, this is, this is the type of play which you watch in lower arenas. Uh, they just go on one side and look at that. He knows the minions are there but he drops it, but he's a pretty good player and he's learning. Um, he's a pretty low level player, but yeah, it's level six, Builder's Workshop, that is great, guys. I was level eight in Builder's Workshop, it's a disgrace, I'm serious, but yeah. I never used to be that good, now I'm pretty good. Um, so he drops the Musketeer and a Bomber without a Meat Shield. Um, yeah, that, those are new tactics. He had a higher level Musketeer, that's how it worked. And the Bomber got a precious shot. But that was a waste, because in the future he was going for the other tower. So let's go times two speed. And let's see, so he drops a giant balloon. It just wrecks the tower. This guy doesn't have enough air defense. In a fast air defense against a raged giant in balloon, he gets wrecked. And then he continues there. Um, that giant was a total waste, and he messed up on the arrows. Too late. Um, and again, it was this giant hog combo. Um, so look at this, guys. On the top... It's giant, I mean, it's on the bottom, it's giant balloon musketeer with a rage. On the top, it's hog, um, witch with her skeletons and archers. So let's make it to half speed and let's see this, guys. One, six. He's way ahead. Dracula's way ahead. But um, he, the other opponent, uh, you can see, has dropped the goblins to defend against the hog rider. And he dropped his, and then Dracula dropped a bomber to go on but this side those rage musketeer and giant and balloon are gonna wreck um so here we see uh, and look at that 398 the balloon's about to get a shot that's the awesome part of it 398 345 932 look how fast it's going 937 345 937 um those arrows are dropping 106 816 guys was so close. Dracula was about to win so closely, and I'm I'm, I'm just pausing and playing uh, frame by frame. Okay, 106, uh, 53, 816. The um, uh, it's about to drop the bomb from the balloon, and it becomes a tie. Amazing. So look at that. I paused it right there to look at that cool screen. It was crazy. That balloon did all of the work and most of it. So that was cool. So uh, forgive me if I lose, but right now I will be playing with this awesome minor deck and in challenges. So let's go. Um, let's see how we can do. And I uh, think I'm going to lose. Oh, level 8. It's going to be a bit easier. So it's a good starting hand. Um, pretty good. Um, let's just wait for what he does. Okay. Okay, that was that was scary. Uh, we need to do this right away, guys. Oh, that was totally wasted. Now we can counter push really, really well. Oh, it's gonna, it's just, oh no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get there, get there. Mega Minion, come on, man. Come on, Mega Minion. Oh, it's full health on the tower, and wow, we're gonna wreck him. That's what happens when you do a double hog push in the beginning of the match. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna reset. We're gonna wait for that hog. Okay, so we're gonna use we're gonna use a zap over here and and, and then a mega and then a mini Pekka to get rid of that of Valkyrie. Um, I just hate Valkyries, you know. Um, so we're gonna keep five elixir for his um, 
So how are we going to defend? We're going to use goblins to defend against that musk tier. So we're going to wait, and now we're going to drop right there. Exactly. It just wastes one goblin on defending it. And now we're going to counter push with fire spirits. Oh no, 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 no. You're going to be here. You're going to be here. You're going to come over here. You're not going to mirror anything. Oh, that was a total waste, guys. It was a total waste. We have a huge elixir advantage right now. No, actually we don't. He wasted four plus two plus three, which is uh, nine. And we also wasted that much. We wasted, in fact, we wasted more than that. Okay, whatever. Uh, we're gonna reset with the princess, because it's the best. Uh, princess, he's barely done any damage. Um, that's good, his musketeer. And, yep, so, maybe. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this. Um, take out that. Take it out. Take it out. Take it out. Take it out. Yes. Took it out. No, no, don't hit it. Come on, don't hit it. Come on. Okay, doesn't matter. We're gonna drop our inferno tower. Okay. Now we're gonna go attack mode. Oh no. We're gonna we're gonna, we're gonna need to this. We're gonna need to do this. Okay. Now we're gonna send. Minor. Oh, we got the tower, guys. We got the tower. Oh my God, miner's great. Now we're gonna do we're gonna do something really really weak and cheap. Right now, um, he messed up. We're gonna use the infernal tower, and the battle's gonna end soon. <laughs> we're just gonna drop whatever we freaking have, um, so that um, yep. Okay, that was a good, that was a great game to showcase this awesome deck. Um, I hope you liked it. Um, so if you have the miner, then well, use this deck because it's great. Four wins, guys. Four wins. It's awesome. And all of them, all of these wins have been with this miner deck. Um, that's awesome. And we're gonna get good, guaranteed those mini cards. Um, oh my God, it's lagging. Okay. Um, so just good look at this deck. It's great. Um, so I'm going to leave you with this. See you next time, guys. Thanks for watching.